This world is actually beautiful after all. Hope the kid's alright. But I wonder how the wife is. Hope she's around one day. What is this place anyway? Wait a minute. I remember a boyfriend playing this game before, back at his house. Ah, okay, now it's hitting me. Stolion. Ran by Princess Elise. Did not like the story. But, it intrigued me. The history that was here. Flames of disaster. Iblis, Nephilus. This is great. This is, could be some great data to learn for the future. Hmm. This must be where the flames are lit. Get into all that. I don't want to get my hands on anything. Let's see. Huh? What's that? I think this might be lead to the forest. Eh. I'll catch it later. Not to look around for. But, what are you gonna do? Hmm. Okay, that's something. Hmm. Now, being out doesn't seem that bad. I thought this world would have been ugly, but hey, guess I'm surprised. I can still fly. Okay. I still, I still find it intriguing. 
wonder if this place will tell me where my wife is. I don't know, but we're in a shot to be sure. are everywhere, are they? Well, let's just go this way. Hmm. Is there anyone really not here? Uh, let's see if I can get a proper view. Soul. Call me Soul Boyfriend. Well, Soul for sure. Soul Boyfriend. Or Soul Down. Is that a Celebi? Uh huh, this is my friend Celebi, and my name is Yana. Okay, big mindfuckery that just happened. <sighs> Your name is Yana. Get a question. What are you two do, do, doing out here? Um, well, we, well, we've been informed it's one of the most safest cities around here, and I'm not a bad guy. We I'm not a bad guy. Trust me, if I was a bad guy, I probably would have killed the both of you already. Oh, well, well, that that, and we would have beaten beaten you up. Smart kid. <laughs> Finally, an adult that agrees with me. <laughs> yeah, <Daddy. laughs> but anyways, but yeah, we were told that this is one of the safest cities here, so Selby and I were just exploring around, and yeah, we just thought that you were a ghost floating about, and we were just wondering where you keep on floating around at. <laughs> uh, yeah, I was just looking around, kind of got you. Kind of getting used to being out of a body. Let's just say boyfriend and I have finally separated. Going on our par parting our ways. Okay. I mean, uh, there's no threats going on, right? As far as I'm aware of, but then again, it's probably a threat that he doesn't need to be involved in. At least from what you've informed me on. I'm sorry? Uh, should we tell him? Daddy. No? Hmm. Well... Yeah, you know, let's just say that... Just so that way it's not... Too confusing, but also we don't word out too much. There's... Apparently, Celebi's actually on a case, uh, currently on a case on looking for two individuals that are roaming around this world. Celebi. Two individuals, huh? Mm -hmm. do, you, do you know their names? Celebi. 
You want? Should we tell them the names or no? Bella. This ain't my problem anyway. Okay. All right. So there's one that she's still trying to uncover, but she got some extra help with it. But another person, the other person from, I know that she had told me about, and that a few others had told me about, is called Mephilus. That rip off a shadow. Oh, uh, 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 She Mephilus. says it's a different, a different Mephilus, because... Well, a long while back, I did have a nightmare of this Mephilus person popping up, but he doesn't look like a... He doesn't look like what you call a ripoff of Mr. Shadow, but looks like a spookier version of Mr. Tommy the Hedgefox. Tommy, Tommy... Ring... Name does ring a bell. Are you talking about that 53 kid? The hedgehog that has number 53 on his, uh, on his car hurdy and on his shirt. Ah, okay. Still not my problem. Oh, no, That's your thing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but so far, according to Celery, there was no other clues besides, uh, well, trying to find out who else is, uh, aware of this Mephilus. Hmm. Best I can tell you, if there's a lot of shadow energy, he should be near. That's the that's the only tip I can give you. Shadow energy. Okay. I like it. Yeah. I don't know if the shadow energy here would be the same as the ones that well I can feel back back home, but still. It'll be but still, at least we know if it's not good energy, it means run. <laughs> It'd be a world, I guess. Like I said, this is not really my concern. I'm just on my own quest. What is your quest, if I may ask? My wife is out there. So, it's is been this more, it's more, been, more it, like it, it's been it's been centuries since I've seen her. Oh, Dude, it was an old corruption incident back way before any of you existed. Well, if it's been centuries, then most likely be before or during when I was born. I guess... I don't know. I don't know when you were born, so... Well... Well, I am 516 years old, so... <laughs> yep, way before. Okay, makes sense. Finally, somebody that understands my age here. <laughs> but you do look like a six-year-old, not gonna lie. I know, but... I think it is a cop, well, kid. I know, I know, sorry, just, uh... I'm still trying to get used to the fact, I don't know, is this ever since, well... I... ever since, well... Uh, I don't know how I'd be able to explain this. You don't, you don't have to if it's gonna hurt your head. Well... Let's just say, long story short... I have what they call a spirit of a warrior. Mm. And even if... And, e and then even if I am, you know, just a little kid still... I always want to go out there and explore the world. And well... well let's say that my explorations had led me here to Mobius and... Found out that my grandma, who's uh, friends with uh, Selby here, had had Selby come along with me for the ride to make sure that I don't get hurt. <laughs> Let me see if I can get her name. 
Is it Azara? Bellaby. Wait, how do you know who she is? Bellaby. I've lived way before any of you. Didn't you forget how Bella long I've Bellaby. been around? I don't Bella know her. Bellaby. I haven't met her, but I know who she is. I've heard her name around. Bellaby. Don't forget I was in boyfriend's body. True. Well, mm. mostly in here. Yeah, I know, but... I never told Mr. Boyfriend about Azara before. I guess you'll find out more in your class, but... I kind of have a little something for you to help you relax a little bit more. You said you're a spirit of a warrior. Every warrior tends to relax. Mm -hmm. Uh, back up, you two. Oh, oh, okay, okay. Let's back up, let's back up. This is for you. I have plenty of them. One of these. Bella. Oh, well, you Bella. two can play it. It's you. It's your two. It, it is not even. And this one's not even you. So if you guys want to use your own powers in it, be my guest. Okay. Hold on. Bella. Oh. 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 Uh, let me. There. Let me uh, trigger it down your size. Hold on. Oh. Bella. Okay. <laughs> I made I made a duplicate for a little uh, Celebi too. Here you go. Celebi. Celebi. All tuned and everything. Don't even need to retune it. Oh, this does make some interesting music. It almost sounds sounds like some of the music that Miss Eighty uh, plays with her bands. <laughs> Oh, it's actually a customizable. You can even change it up. Look. See this button right here? You can even change it to acoustic. Now. Okay. Now, now, now it definitely sounds like music I'm used to. <laughs> <laughs> I like you, Bo. You know what? You know what, kid? I like you. Maybe I'll see you more soon. Oh. <laughs> oh. Thanks, Mr. Soul. <laughs> hmm. Well, it's best I'd be going off. I'm a busy guy after all. Oh, that's true, and good luck on finding your wife soon. And good luck fulfilling the quest that you're doing. Oh, <laughs> thank you. Okay. And, and, what I'm, and what you guys told me, I can tell you two are definitely gonna need it. That would be. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. Well, see ya. Okay. How the hell did her she even get to this timeline? Ah, no. This. I believe she's this way. <laughs> 